wait, this isn't too hard, but then now you're on your hand and, the, and then contracting at the same time, which that can get uncomfortable. And then holding it there for how many eight counts? Probably for a four count, maybe. No, just kidding. Jeez, I bet. All right, YouTube, we are analyzing NCTU Seventh Sense requested by Neff. You guys are at request, head on over to the Patreon uh, where you can put in requests and watch exclusives like my reactions to Road to Kingdom. And yeah, if you just want to hang out with us on the Twitch, feel free to do so so we can talk. You can watch me just talk to myself as you guys send me words. Anyways, let's head on over to this analysis. Am I saying you're right? Because Chad told me that I always point him out as a Taeyong, Taeyong, Taeyong. But yeah, he's a great performer. Just preemptively saying that. This is a sick shirt want it shouts out to these guys performing with hats and that extra stuff because i feel like this would be like whoosh, 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 in her face or i don't know i would be distracted so shout out to shout out to them oh my god this is them setting up right now i just i feel the anticipation myself oh just because the feeling of just getting ready and then you hear the crowd, you just got to wait and contain your energy and then you go. Oh, it's hard like sometimes because like you're here with just waiting and then you got to go with like, 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 bah, really fast. So that's why you, sometimes you see some dancers when they're going to do some choreography in class or bouncing around because it keeps your energy up. And then when you do your choreography, bah, 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 but you standing still, you're there with the excitement and you have to contain it before you go. And sometimes uh, if like, especially for me when I was performing in the beginning, sometimes I would be so excited, I would end up going off count. That is an ep super far butt slide. Bow! Literally had to move a spot. Oh, he, he, he like reached and pulled. Same with him. Nice strong beginning because uh, there's so much motion happening. I feel like this is like what YouTubers do right now or very Mr. Beast like, very like snappy cuts, high energy movements. Like from this very strong starting position, we got a nice little triangle shape for design here. Oh, actually let's go with the blue. Nice triangle shape right here nice purposeful placing of the of where they are and then we then you go into the very fast motions and then slowing it down ba -da -da -da, slow a nice little moment to control very nice and sync with the movement because it feels like they're on a little slider right now see that and then shouts out to Taeyang whoever choreographed this for him to go on to a bridge practically because now oh center of gravity is right here and then wait this isn't too hard but then now you're on your hand and the, and then contracting at the same time which that can get uncomfortable and then holding it there for how many eight counts probably for a four count maybe one two three four six seven for an eight count about or no just kidding geez about two eight counts because then there's a level drop and a very sudden, yeah, boom, drop, up, reach, into into what? CC? Oh no, I thought it was just a knee drop. Knee drop, but uh, he had the hardest part of this whole, that whole thing, man. Cause that is core strength, shoulder strength. He has, these two have the easiest job. Probably he has the easiest job cause he's, he's kind of leaning. Oh, interesting. Oh, okay, that's kind of like more of their own thing. Got it. Man, he executed that effortlessly. What are foreign swaggers?
this is a minor thing here. And this is just one of the things that you can practice and have your blocking on point is all you want. Uh, sometimes it's just, it's just not going to be 100%. That's why I say like 99% you're going to get it right. There's a, the 1% that is off. This is that 1% spacing here. They probably had a tech rehearsal. I'm assuming they did a tech rehearsal to, to get used to the floor because not all floors are the same. Dad's floor uh, is different like at a studio or Marley floor. And then this, I don't know, I can't tell what the what the stage is from here. So it's, it makes sense where they can get used to the floor, the spacing. Some places have markers so they know where they are. But even then, even all your preparation, there's always going to be that a little bit. But it's not like a make or break thing. Make or break would be like she's someone like falls and then they completely just stop doing choreography or they just blank out and they just don't do anything. All right, uh, whoever's editing this, the question about the the foreign swaggers, keep that part. <laughs> oh, that was like a nice little little swivel step. Nice little footwork right there. The footwork is very subtle because they're not big. It's very more inward silhouettes, kind of a heel toe back. That was nice. Upper body stiff here. See that? Look how much more. Shoulders need to relax a bit. Look at him. He's yeah, Look at that. See the difference? This is again. This is just like an example of choreographer being nitpicky of like individual performances, but as a group, it looks fantastic. I love that move. Is that a chest pop or is that a body roll? Body roll. Yo, he's going off. Look at that. He's liquid. This one, I like how he's doing it because it's a little bit more subtle. It's not like too in your face. Damn, he travel. Where the fuck are you going? My God. From, okay, stage left to all the way to stage right. And same with this guy. These guys are moving. That's a lot of effort. And then you still got to sing. Oops, you're out there. And he's back into the middle. Jeez. Spacing is a little... I'm just sharing, simply sharing with you guys what I'm seeing. Nice. That was going from super fast to the lyrics. And and slow. Nice texture change right there. Beautiful. Nice groove there. Great transition. Going back to going, they're going back straight to like the very strong, big movements. Boom, boom. Nice level change. I love that. Oh, it's yeah. This looks good. Look at that. Perfect. Nice jump. He's a little early. Timing's still great. In real time, it's great. But it's like, this jump turn looks fantastic. Uh, it felt clean. It looks clean too. It just feels good because it just felt like, boom, stop. And it felt very controlled and didn't feel chaotic on the landing. Ooh. What is that? A little bounce. Bounce. Okay, it's a step. Up, up, uh, pivot. Down. Yeah, bounce, bounce, da da da. See these moments right here. Boom. These choreographed moments where these guys are just relaxing and breathing and they are not looking at the audience. When I do that, this from my experience, when I'm looking not, not looking at the audience, I'm like, <gasps> okay. <laughs> so I don't know if they're doing it because 
they have a camera right here as well so they're shit out of, <laughs> kind of from hiding <laughs> but whenever i have a chance to look away from the audience i just try to catch my breath and just be like <gasps> Man, they are moving so much here. It's like very much like, I don't know. It's like, it feels like an organism that's just evolving. Boom, because they, they just got to that spot and they didn't even stay there for like even uh, two counts. As soon as these two got here, they went here right off the bat, dude. Oh, and they move. Da, 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 da. Okay, he was having a solo moment. I thought he dropped early. Maybe he did. Dropped early. Because then he was about to go back up and then he went back into his part. But either way, it's, it's his part was coming up. I couldn't tell. God, again, the movements. Move. Hop. Duh. Nice texture change. Oh, this is so good too. The nice little texture change slowing it down. So you're still very involved, but they can they have a moment to breathe. Love that. Going from the big movements. Boom. Da 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 boom. Da. Love the texture changes that they're, they're just giving. Because they they're they going from like here, these big movements, big movements. Then they bring it up, uh, slow it down. Boom. Do -do -do boom. That just, ah, uh, nice contrast from everything. Going back to the quick movements. Slowing it down again. Nice grooves. Shouts out to the, shouts to the study cam. <laughs> Very big body rolls there. And uh, nice and subtle with the hands happening right here so again that's definitely more of a moment for like great for the music video oh great for a close-up because it's more subtle with the shimmery hands little jazz hands then do the drop the boom now the spacing is far here Woo! No beats too? That is hard. Dun, dun, dun. What are those counts? Seven, eight, one, two, and a three, and a four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, done. Okay, but that was fast. I just went straight into counting. I like how the, everything was it was fast and then slowed everything down. One, four, six, seven, eight, go. Slowing it down, letting them have their moment, really be to be more performers. Choreography is not overly complex at these at these moments. Smart. I like that. A lot of the choreography before that was very like was really building up in terms of difficulty, and I'm like, holy shit, what the fuck? <laughs> but I like how they uh, shout out to the chore choreographer. I think that was a great choice of like slow things down at the end to give them. It's it's. I think it was like maybe three three accounts, four accounts, just to breathe with a quick moment to 
quick moment um so that way they can they can breathe because the uh i know these shows they, they they do the whole ending varies thing so it would suck after you to just go into that after like doing an a count four a counts of the most intense choreography of your life so i love that choice of like slowing down the choreography let it be a performance moment nothing too complex uh and then by the end of it they can by that moment they're not recovered in terms of catching their breath but you know they're, they won't be as dead compared to doing intense choreography yeah not much else to add uh, from the analysis shout out to Neff for the the request i appreciate you and uh, let's hop on to the next one all right so that's it if you want more head on over here and do all the things watch more and if you want early early access and if you want to request make sure you become a patron that's the only way i'm going to be handling requests